Hello, welcome back. Let's get into contract number four. Not getting any sound from the con tracker. Weird. Um, I hope my mic's not unplugged as well. But no matter, no matter, we're gonna get right into this. So there's a choice between doing another defense class, which I would have to do with he go with heavy, of course, because I can dominate people as heavy, defend objectives as heavy, or I could go through here and either do the gunslinger, the brass beast, or the lock and load. Now, now the biggest problem right here is that two two consecutive direct hits with the lock and load can be done. But it's going to take time. And a five kill streak with a lock and load? Are you kidding me? I have to get a real. I, I would really have to get a group of dumb people to pull that off. Uh, Brass Beast. Take a thousand damage in a single life. No! No! I'm not doing that. And then Wrangler. Get get a melee kill with the gunslinger. Crit kill. There are two options for that. Either I do the hit them three times and and uh, get a crit thing, which they fixed, so you can't exploit that out. Or or we could get somebody with a crit screen, but I can't be bothered with that. We could also play Lazarus. Will require us to defend and capture the control point. And we'll get just getting the Yeti stuff. There's also the thing involving whether I want cash or a or a case. Hmm. What a puzzle. Uh, I haven't gone lock and load in a while. I guess I could do that. But these bonus objectives are really going to hurt me in the long run. I, I, gotta, I, gotta, I gotta go lock and load. Alright, let's do it. Find a game. Jump in. Third time's not the charm. What did they fix this time? What did they fix this time? Small update. Probably a crash fix. Fixed the firing speed. The pretty boy's pocket pistol. Fished, fin fixed a server crash related to contracts. Fished, fixed a crash related to taunting. Updated the Dragon's Fury so the 20 health extinguishing thing works. Abandoned disconnect dialogues now show controller hint icons. And removed trade restrictions from the printy items. Mm. Alright, that's good. I approve of that. 100% approve of that. You cannot trade those genuine print, printing items. So I've got a really interesting story involving a locked car and a corded phone. It might also be the explanation as to why I published the uh, third contract so late, but well, let's get everything working and well, the sound's back. That's good. But I, I want to make sure everything's working so that I'm not talking over something you don't hear me talk about. Isn't that right, future Gandalf? Yes, yes, I will keep my spirits up. 
But you already know what's going to happen to me. You already know. And that also means... Ah, it means I've got wig in my eye. It means... I'm playing Demo Man. Yeah. The expert or ordinance. I didn't even know that was a thing. So could two consecutive direct hits with the lock and roll. Sniper, 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 sniper. Snipers! Three snipers. So there's the two blue ones. Where's my red button? My red buddy needs a hug from the lock and load. Come on. That's one consecutive. The control point is being contested. Avert. The control point is being contested. See if I can't find someone standing still. There we go. I could do this, I just require some precision. Thank you. Mission ends in 30 seconds. We should probably capture that point. I can do this, this shouldn't be too hard. I mean, I know the lock and load's meant for sentries, but I think I can do this. Mission ends in ten seconds. Oh. 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 oh, someone's steam off ticket has been revoked. They probably got back banned. <laughs> Alright, so everything goes well, and it looks like we already got 19 points, so I'm gonna cut the chase. I go to work, and then I go to college. Particularly today. One directly to the other. I didn't bring lunch, uh, lunch today, so I was hungry. I go to class, do my class thing, and I go to get in my car. And I've locked myself in my car. I've locked my keys inside the car. There's like, oh, just, just, there's probably a door code or something. No, the locks aren't even connected between the doors. There's no button to unlock all or lock all on the inside. So of course there's not going to be anything to fix the locks. I couldn't have a fob. So, what do I do? Well, the first thing I have to do is figure out... Maybe, maybe some, one of my idiot family members left one of the back doors unlocked, like they do. And, you know, I don't, use, I don't use those doors very often, so if a car happened to have the door unlocked, I wouldn't know until I checked. No, they locked all the doors like they were supposed to. What next? <laughs> That guy's awesome. So, what do we do next? We call whoever has the spare key. In my family. So I go inside and ask if they have a phone I can use. I don't like using cell, phone num cell phones, but there's always a landline somewhere. Somewhere. There's always a landline. So I go search out this one. I go ask a janitor for the landline after like four other people because they didn't know if there was a phone in the in the in the building. Dang it I lost that. 
There is a loser. Whatever. So I did they tell me oh oh it's upstairs. Next to the uh student services. Oh how convenient, I'll go up there. It was a landline, alright. Quite a beauty as well. You know how old plastic used to be white, but then it faded yellow? That's what we're dealing with here. It was a wall-mounted phone with a handlebar receiver and a cord and a keypad. You know, you had to hit 9 to do outside calls. Which, I had to figure out myself, by the way. Consecutive kills don't count against sentry guns. So, uh, I, I mean, I know how to use these phones. It was just... A, it, ju it was just confusing. And it's funny, because there was also... There was also... A... Sign, a tattered worn sign above the phones asking to keep the calls to three minutes because there was a line. Surprise! There was no line. Nobody knew it was up there. Or if somebody knew it was up there, they never even thought about it being up there. So, of course, I had free reign over this ancient piece of technology. First thing I do is I call my family, right? Call my family at home and ask, Hey, I'm locked out of my car. Can you bring the spare key down? Turns out the spare key is not only on another car key ring, but that car just so happened to be out somewhere with a person in it. And so my family freaks out and figures, and uh, panic to, to uh, remember the cell phone number of said person because they do have a cell phone I don't there's no reason I just don't and this is probably a reason I should so I get the phone number out of them and of course it takes a while because they are who they are so I get the phone number, I hang up on them because I'm done with them, <laughs> and, they're, and they're still arguing over the phone number even though I wrote it down and heard it multiple times. So I call, so I, I go to call a number. Now this particular family member is not too keen on a answering random numbers. By not too keen, I mean they won't unless you convince them to and even then so of course I could with a cell phone I could have just texted the number with an explanation but I've got a coiled cord and a set and a keypad so the best thing I can do is brute force it and just keep calling the number until I get an answer and I did after about eight times <laughs> Let's get an answer, and I figure out where what's going on with, with that family member who was out at the store. And what? And so they tell me, okay, I'm gonna be right over there. Now I didn't figure this out till later. But apparently, my family had decided to go track the other family member down. The other family member had not mentioned that they had gone to the nearest Walmart, and the family guessed. They guessed pretty well because when after after the family member hung up with me on the phone, they turned to see yet another family member with a call staring into the window, ready to tell them the same thing again. Hey, I hey, Williams locked away somewhere. He's, he's locked out of his car at, at the college, <laughs> which just thoroughly. Uh, describes how the dynamic works with communication in our family. Anyway, anyway. They get the key to me, I get to come home. And 
Now I'm here recording this. Oh, patience, my friend, patience. There we go. Awesome load contract that it takes not too long, but a decent amount of time. Ding ding, the train goes forward, but I'm just mildly annoyed. Am I allowed to be annoyed at something like that? Thank you, medic. Yeah, I got points there. Five kill streak with a lock on. I'm doing that on my own time. I'm sorry, but I have to do that on a two fort map with those oblivious snipers. You know the ones, the sticky jumper. No, no matter, no matter. I'll deal with that right now. I'm gonna get this crate and I'm gonna open it for your enjoyment. Just to kill doesn't count. Or a kill with the lock and load. Okay, okay. So I'm just mildly mad, and I hope you enjoy my story and my rant, because heaven knows I'm not telling it again. I've got the anger off my back there. So, on to bigger questions. What should I get with a Dragon Slayer skin? Should I get a Medigun? A knife! Because with most of my things, I have exactly what I wanted. What do you think you're doing? Put on a disguise, you fool! Put on a disguise! Don't go the jetpack, they're coming for me. Oh, I like that guy's loadout. Yeah, what, what should I get? Because everything I have a skin for all of the things they have, except the dragon fury. But I don't want. I don't want a shiny new dragon fury. I I I want one of the other ones. What should I get? I'm thinking the mini gun, the medi gun, because I like my strange civil servant. But I'd like a what a quick to a better Australian, just a little bit more. Oh. Sergeant Deathwish. I love I, I love military joke names like uh, General Nonsense, Major Stupidity, Sergeant Deathwish, Colonel Sanders. It, it, it's funny. Oh, well, Colonel Sanders technically isn't one, but when you run, when you use a military name and open up a restaurant, it's gonna stop being a military name and start being a joke. Those are just the facts of life. Where is he? Where is he? Yay points! But halfway to the contract already? Huh? Yeah, I'm gonna have to do some oblivious snipers to get that five kill streak. This thing is not good. 
against Constantine people. It never has been. If somebody knows you have this, you're not gonna win. I thought I was just one from there. <laughs> you put a telly up here. It's where they stuff a thing! Ah <laughs> Discount Gandalf's been going well. People like them. People seem to like it. Discount Gandalf he's into their things. The Harlem Teeter Totters. That's a good one. There's only three in the flip that makes it a lot more complicated. So I have one chance for failure against getting the points. You shall not pass guns. <clears throat> I wish you could put the war paints on weapons. I wish I had a choice to do that. Cause actually, here's a question: Why can't I put a skin on the back burner? War paint. Sorry. Why can't I put a war paint on the back burner? I've been too. Your back is a health pack. <laughs> uh, I love these people. These are good people. Points for me. That guy loves killing me. It's too bad his loadout sucks. I mean, mine's not much better, but decent. These beret man, I don't know that I'm a pirate. Bloody I, I can't do this. Not I can't do this five kill for six. And then not with the not with not with my current position. That's one. That's two. That's one. That's zero. That's one as well. I don't mean to be in a rush with this whole contract thing, but I, I've got other things to do. I've got to fly for next semester classes. They get past that, I huh, stinker. How'd they get back there? Why'd they go back there? How easy is it going to be to kill kill them? Oh. 
I wasn't getting out of there. <laughs> hair in my mouth. Hair in my mouth, hair in my eye. I can't wait for Halloween, it's gonna be fun. I work on Halloween and that's kinda sad, right? But I work at day shift. And... Permitting all the guidelines are intact. I can wear a costume. You know, I can run the front counter like this. With a hairnet on my beard and my wig tied back. I mean my real hair. Mission ends in 60 seconds. There's no way this could go terribly wrong. <laughs> the card is nearing a checkpoint. Oh, the bloody card is moving ends in thirty seconds. Oh. 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 This guy's good at reflecting. Oh, oh, that, that, I'm not taking that. That was bad. I'm sorry. That was a wasted shot, but I can't, I can't do that. So the team's pretty good. But. Well, turn in section one. Mission begins in sixty seconds. I, I pretty much have to do the uh, consecutive direct hits thing twice, and then we're out of here. Open that box, take a look at what we found. Hope it's not leaves again. <laughs> I I like it. I liked it on some of the weapons. Well there are some of the weapons where I'd rather definitely something else. Like uh, the the like the uh The loose cannon. I have plans for the loose cannon. I really, really want either a merc count or, or either a either a kill count or an ironwood loose cannon particularly the the ironwood loose cannon that's one it's a heavy One more. Either a kill or a, or a or a consecutive direct hits. Either way, we've got this in the bag. These have been pretty good. I, I'm enjoying these contracts thoroughly. Uh, no, I'm not a demo man main just because I'm. I'm not a demo man. As I was saying, I'm not a demo man main. I just I'm just good at I'm just good at playing him. I rather play Spy. I love Spy, especially the new Year Eternal Reward. I I can't wait to do a contract on the uh, as as the Spy, because then I can show you exactly what I mean by that. Tom's rocket launcher. So we just gotta finish out this round. I'm not worried about the bonuses at the moment, so. Hey, let's go spy now! I was talking about spy, I wanted to be spy, I'm gonna be spy! Spy! Now, 
Now the new Yuri Tunnel reward. It's fun. I love it. Specifically because for well, one, it's done this like it's always like it always has. Oh. No matter. Quickly, everyone in my dog. All right, I'm done. I'm done. Let's do this. Turn it in. Get something beautiful. All right, let's tear this box open. Ah. Weird thing going on there with the thing. All right, let's 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 go through, you know, the deal. Alright, I'll show you what's cool and what's not. Detonator. Detonator one looks- the, the detonators set up with everything looks really good. That's kind of nice for a whip. Family business. Not bad, not bad. Flamethrower. Iron bomber. It almost looks dark cartoony with those lines. The jag. Uh oh. Knife? Mm -mm. Persian Persuader, we're not even going to talk about that. Pistol. Hmm. Power Jack. Hmm. I'm thinking about it. Rescue Ranger. Pretty cool too if I used the rescue ranger. Oh, that is nice. That's nice. That's nice. Shotgun. SMG. You know. Yeah. Yeah. yeah whoop de do. Sniper rifle. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice. Soda popper. Everything looks good on the soda popper. Because you can paint the can. They thought of that. You know what that looks like. Thomas Lob. Pretty cool, but I've got a cow. Uber saw. It might as well be the other one, except with less color. Except with less texture. Winger! That is awesome wrench wrench is a wrench um hmm debating 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 i mean jack of the winger what does the winger do again? Didn't they change it to do something else? What does it do? Damage bonus, bonus and jump height. I, 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 got, I gotta go with the power jack. That's that is nice. I I have I am I thoroughly approve this power jack skin. Let's go test this out in game. I like this. I, 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 I'm, I'm happy with my choice here. 
Yeah, but no matter. Come on, scumbag. Shoot straight. Not you. Alright. See you in the next contract. Bye.